Hi guys, Dr. K here. Welcome to a new series of lessons, Legendary Boogie Riffs. And this series of lessons is going to be based on a video I did, the last video I did, which is called Boogie Woogie Riffs, The Ultimate Collection. It's where I, John Carter, Big John Carter, went through a whole load of boogie riffs. And this series of lessons is going to take all the riffs in that lesson and break them down and slow them down for you. So if you like the mothership, the mother video is that 22 minute, no it's actually a 27 minute long video, it's called Boogie Woogie Riffs The Ultimate Collection and I want you to have a look at that video, it's 27 minutes long and there's a whole load of boogie riffs in that, that Big John Carter plays and what I'm going to do in this series of lessons is take every one of those riffs and break it down and play them individually so I hope that makes sense, does that make sense camera person? It does indeed. Okay so Boogie Woogie Riffs The Ultimate Collection, have a look at that, it's 27 minutes long and then this, this series of lessons is going to take those videos and slow them down. So the first uh, riff that I want to do, if you look at that video, is this kind of chunky left hand. Come over here, camera person. Now, we know the chop is one of the first boogie boogie riffs we learn, but this one, this is a kind of, actually, I'll play it an octave down because it sounds a bit grittier. Instead of doing the chop, if you're playing blues piano, you might want to play a whole chord like that and make it kind of Albert Ammon style. So instead of playing the chop, to get that really kind of gritty, almost dirty sound, you play a chord and put a trill in the right hand. So all your hand is bouncing. You know, it's a lot chunkier when you play it as a chord. first riff in the legendary boogie collection and what I would like you to do is when you've mastered that left hand see if you can start improvising just the blue scale or some trills in the right in the right hand and put it together and that chunky kind of blues left hand gives it that really authentic Albert Ammon style you know Albert Ammon's always played a very kind of chunky left hand so see if you can practice that and that's the first one of our legendary boogie riffs I mean spend a week doing it um, playing it with the right hand makes it a little bit tricky you probably can get it just playing it with the left hand but when you put the right hand with it it's quite demanding in terms of your coordination as always press that like button visit the Dr K boogie community page on Facebook I hope you've got the sheet music transcriptions the badass boogie bundles which you can uh, if you're following these lessons you do need the bundles, you've got all the sheet music there at www.badassboogie.com and all the, all the stuff we've got on that page to help you with your boogie woogie studies. And I will talk to you very soon. Well said, camera person.